Hey, what's up, guys? It's GB with Tech Tight Reviews, and today I'm going to bring you a quick look and review at the Tone Infinim Bluetooth wireless headphones from LG. Now, these are a very interesting set of headphones. They were originally launched in 2012 and, of course, met with a little bit of hesitation just because of the new and kind of weird design. But over time, I think people grew to love these and it's become a hit. So the Tone Infinims, you can see, uh, they come nicely packaged. Um, this is the gloss black color and it's just really nice to look at. A little bit of a fingerprint magnet, um, but you get that with any of the gloss devices that are, are coming out today. That's just a side effect of looking good. Um, either you hate it or you love it or you can just learn to live with it. Um, you can see it's kind of a unibody design. A little bit different from some of the earlier models that had a little more flexibility. This one has a little bit of a rigid uh, setting so it's just kind of not as flexible maybe not going to be able to fit in your pocket as well as some of the older models but um, I have to admit I really like this design it fits on the neck good it's light you almost don't know it's there so that's really interesting I'm um, taking a look at some of the accessories that uh, come with the tone infinims uh, nothing really fancy of course you're not gonna get a lot of cables because it's a Bluetooth uh, wireless headset um, you're gonna get you some quick start guides also in the box, let me see what else is in here. Okay, you have a charging cable, obviously. Um, this thing has great battery life, which is definitely an update from some of the other ones. They've always had good battery life, but I think you're gonna get you know several days of use. You also have some ear uh, tips, different sizes, you know, just because everybody has different sizes of ears, and that's always helpful. Um, and you know just information so other than that not much going on you don't really get a charging block you have to plug it in a USB or something of that nature I'm taking a look at the headset itself you can see it's a really clean design you have a track fast forward and play pause button on one side of the device and on the other you have a call button you know to answer and stop your calls and on the other side you have your volume rocker so let me see if I get that in focus there it is so as I said these are Bluetooth so of course they pair with a smartphone or some other device that has Bluetooth and LG included a very nice app which is handy I don't know how useful it is but it does you know have some usability the tone and talk app and I found that you know this is something that will detect your incoming messages and help you interact with different social media apps so that's pretty cool um, the app is only for Android so that's one thing you should keep in mind so iOS guys are out of luck for now as you can see it has a really uh, non-invasive design I mean with a collared shirt they're completely hidden and voila there they are nice and clean And here's those retractable earbuds we were talking about. This is just one of the most clever designs I've seen and it allows you to listen to your music with just these really thin wires which are surprisingly robust. You'd be surprised that these they look dainty but they're not. They're really strong like a braided cable and these they sound great. Really enjoyable, light in the ear. You almost don't know you have them on and I think that's what LG was going for. Now on both sides of the device there's two buttons, one for each of the earbuds and see there you can go ahead and depress those and they quickly and easily retract and you're ready to go. Now Bluetooth range on this device you're going to get about 25 feet or so before it starts to act up which I find is fine. I mean in most cases you're probably going to have your phone in your pocket if you have to sit it down on the counter for a minute uh, no big deal at all. And like I said, the battery is going to last about several days or so. Um, as far as the audio quality, of course, these are stamped with Harman Kardon, so you're going to get really good sound. The Harman Kardon engineers have worked with LG to try to get you a good sound and, you know, optimize them for these headphones. Um, so no complaints there. Bass, bass is punchy. The mids and highs are very clear. So I really enjoyed listening to these headphones. Now, outside of the fingerprint you know being everywhere because of the glossy design I really can't find a lot of cons with this set of headphones um, if you're a bass head you may find yourself a little wanting on the bass side it's not you know 
Beats by Dre type of bass, but it's clean, it's punchy, and I think sufficient for most people. Either way, I think these headphones shine in a multitude of ways and are going to far outweigh any cons that you might come up with. They sound great, they look great, and they're comfortable to wear, and they're going to be great for people working out and just doing day-to-day -day activities. So I hope you guys enjoyed this first look and a quick review on the Tone Infinim Bluetooth wireless headphone from LG. Um, if you like this video, of course, please hit that like button, go crazy on it, and uh, make sure you subscribe because I'll be bringing a lot of content to the channel here in the, in the near future. Until next time, guys, I appreciate it. Thanks for stopping by. It's GB with Tech Type Reviews. We'll see you next time.